Hello there and welcome back to the NASCAR E5 Career Mode. Three races left until the playoffs. We go to Kentucky today. Let's give you a look at the points. So here's what the playoffs are looking like so far. We lead the way. Six wins, seven stage wins. A lot of playoff points. Fun. Uh, Friesen with two wins and everybody else with one. Sauter, Hill, Ben Rhodes, Crafton, Tanner Gray now moved up in there as well and shuffled it around. So now it's down to the guys who are either going to point their way in who you know, there's only a couple of guys who really have a shot at it, and it's basically just Todd Gill, and Christian Eckes is uh, pretty far out of it now. Still a lot can happen in three races, but uh, it looks like it's just going to come down to Ross Chastain and Todd Gill. And... But you never know, somebody also new can win their way in and shuffle it up even more. All right, on to Kentucky we go. Hello. Here we go, Kentucky Speedway. Uh, should be good. Tate Fogelman would be a pal. <laughs> Jason White's dumbass, look at him. <laughs> Is it nearly as fast as expected? Those are always the best. And it's a change after qualifying. All right, Josh. Well, this should be good. Three races left until we, until we get to the playoffs. Stuart Friesen starting on uh, the Three front row here. We'll keep go. an eye on uh, Ross Chastain and old Todd. Got a car now. Both up here, so points are going to be tight, especially stage points. Got eight laps. What are we looking like on field? Twelve. Got should be a good time. Oh, baby. I don't know where to go. Toughest corner in NASCAR, don't forget it. Uh -huh. Hello, how you doing? Pick, pick, <laughs> pick, pick a lane. I was, man, I really thought I was gonna eat shit down there. I got my left around the yellow line a little underneath of it. Uh -huh. Oh, here we go. Oh, please turn, thank you. This thing's actually turning pretty good off the bat. I don't think that's a good thing. Hey, Brett, if you'd like to go to the wall, that'd be much appreciated. You still got, you still got some room? Oh, he about done did it. Ah, I enjoy arcing in the corner. Oh my lord. They uh looks like they mismarked the apron a little bit. <laughs> I think the track flattened out a little bit before I got to the line. Oh yeah, we're fucked. My my right rear is already 68%. We've done how many laps have we done? Five We've done uh it. four. Yeah, that's not good. Oh she get oh she getting slippery. She getting slippery. We're gonna have to snug this thing up a good bit for the next run. It's great on the short run, though. We don't usually have that. Yeah, no, these guys are just going to drive up underneath of me. All right, well, it was fun. All right, we're just going to we're gonna, we're gonna do one of those. Yeah. All right, well, yeah, we're going we're gonna to tighten it up a little bit then. Okie dokie. Well, eight spots lost. Had a lot of damage to fix. To uh, but uh, that's all right. Ready. We'll get him. Truck's good as new. Look at this. Couldn't even tell. <laughs> Just fucking ate shit on the back stretch. All right, nine yeah. laps. Uh, we tightened it up a good bit here. It's uh, it's it's probably still gonna chew the right rear one way or another, but it should it should be a little bit better this time around. Here we go. Ooh. Pull the hell out of that top. Hell yeah. Oh, I see a hole. <laughs> Got one Sweet. All right, I found another hole. Uh -huh. I'm going back to the top down here. Come on, Austin Hill, where are you going? Top, medium, middle, the wreck, raw. Uh, oh, now I'm in the middle. Okay, you can do this. Oh, now I'm up here. All right. Hey, thank you, Austin Hill. I, he said, "Fuck that shit." Don't blame him. All right, man, where are we going, pal? You know, it's crazy. I don't know if I mentioned it in the video or not, but it was crazy that he won a championship in between a three-year, like, winless streak. <laughs> like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> Only a NASCAR, man, where you could... His last win was 2017, the, the Eldora race. Won a championship in between just three years of not winning a race. And then finally won, was it Michigan or something? I don't know what the hell he won. He won something. Is there any Matt Crafton fans? Does Matt Crafton have any fans? He's gonna have like three, right? I just, I don't think I've ever heard of anybody who, who's just like sat down to watch a truck race, to watch their favorite driver, Matt Crafton. Am I right? Uh, I don't know. Any oh, Matt Crafton fans watching? Like legitimate Matt Crafton fans? I'm interested to hear from you. Tell us about it. <laughs> Really wish I could get around him though. So you don't really want to pick a lane. I can't drive. See that little seam there? That's where the apron and like 
the apron and the, the track connect. But the fucking, uh, the line is underneath of it. Oh, man, no! No, I am, no! Oh, somebody just fucking piled in there. <laughs> oh, well, that stinks. Well, that's gonna be the end of that. Uh, come down, pit again, I guess. The car was actually, excuse me, the truck was actually pretty good with that adjustment, I gotta say. Um, we'll see what it does, though. This is gonna be the longest run of the race. Unless we get a caution right in the middle. There we go. Okie dokie. Well, we got uh, 22 laps remaining. Oh, hold on. Restart gear. See ya. I like when you make it three wide and they just fucking nope the fuck out of there. <laughs> Alright, to the lead. Don't mind if I do. Hell yeah. Alright, well, that was fun. See how long I can hold on to it before I inevitably lose it. We're actually holding on to it. For now. They're just kind of hanging back there. I don't like it. They're just looking at me. Whoever that is back here, Brett and Zane Smith. I think it's Brett Moffat. Yeah. Made some adjustments though, man. This thing's really good. I feel like I didn't really lose any speed on the short run. I don't know. We still haven't really gone all that long, but it doesn't seem to be snapping as much. It's kind of weird. It's almost like the adjustments did what they were supposed to. <laughs> I'm still burning the right rear more than I am the right front. I'm not comfortable with that. But it's, uh, it's not wrecking. And that's underappreciated, I gotta say. I think I'm driving away. What the hell? I think I am. Yeah, look at that. Nine tenths. Oh, shit. Hold on. Might have a race winning truck today, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, well, here's the fun part. <laughs> We're running out of everything all at the same same uh, time here. Down to 17% on the right rear. We're bad out of fuel. And we're also right on the fuel window, so uh, 13 laps. we got to go at least another lap. But we should be all right. Should. Take care of the tires. I really hope I don't blow right rear. I just lost like 4% there in the same corner. Down to 11. Oh, boy. 10. Everybody count with us. 9. Uh, 8. Oh, fuck me. 7. I'm not going to. All right. We need fuel. Let's pit now. I'm going to blow a fucking tire before the time. I, I, uh, I, just, I lost a percent on the. Oh, no. This ain't good. Uh, I can, I mean, I can bet, oh, 4%. How do I lose tire like that? I understand it's on four times, but like, gotta take care of the I'm gonna, tires. I'm gonna blow a tire. I might be, I might, I might just, oh my God. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 You blew a tire. Fuck! Back it down, back it down. Skills! Skills gotta be low, driver. Let's hit this lap. I'm, I made it! <laughs> it's still green. It says I have damage. I mean, I got. Ah, oh, fuck. I guess I gotta fix that, don't I? Oh, Jesus Christ. Alright, well. <laughs> At least I got that close. Still a little 360. And, uh. What the hell? Oh, boy. 16 seconds. That should be a, still a pretty good stop. All right, we'll see where we come out of here. There's Angela getting herself some pits. There's Zane Smith. How you doing? All right, we're out. Uh, there we are. All right now, dig, dig, dig. Yeah, we're gonna have to fucking hustle because we're gonna lose time to everybody, and I probably won't come out as the leader. I would imagine. Go. Oh, never mind. I think I will come out as the leader. Oh, eat shit, everybody! <laughs> eat shit! Eat shit! Hell yeah! I blew a tire. Did a 360. Took time to fix my damage on pit road and still came out as a leader. Eat shit. <laughs> Hell yeah. All right, that's how you fucking do it right there. And somehow we got all the way through green flag pit stops without having a caution. How the fuck did we do that? Hi, Austin. Bye, Austin. Are you gonna fucking keep Okay, I wasn't sure. Oh, my. Fucking last row, Joe. There we are. Okie dokie. Yeah, eight laps. Uh, nine laps on fuel. I mean, it's it's kind of close, but we're all right. The right rear should hold on. I, if we lose 71% of right rear tire in that amount of time, that's going to suck. So we got a, a second and a half on Brett Moffitt. Uh, 1.4 seconds. He is catching me a little bit. But lap, lap traffic is playing a factor for both of us. So there's Tyler Ingram, 27th. 
didn't he win Kentucky? Like his only his only win, I think. I feel I think I missed watching that race, but I, I mean I remember it happening. Got him running 27th in the game. Feels bad, man. That sucks. Got a couple of people rim riding up here. A couple of back markers. Now we see why they're back markers. Am I right? That gap's growing. Three seconds on Brett. I uh, I don't know about y'all, but I'm sm I'm smelling some dickhead balls here in Kentucky. Smelling might not have been the right word. I've never been to Kentucky though. Does it smell like dick and balls here? Fucking corn cob. Look at corn cob rib riding. What you doing up there, corn cob? What you doing? Outside. <laughs> Who the fuck is that? Is that Natalie Decker up there? Fucking rim riding the hardest corner in NASCAR. Beast. Oh fuck. How many laps have we got to go? Oh fuck me. White flag. Next time by. Don't say the white flag. The what? The words? Why the? The words, if the, if, if it ain't the white flag, you shouldn't be saying white flag, all right? All right am I gonna lose 15% in this lap and a half? On the tires. Oh, boy. All I think right. we'll be Clear okay. Uh, yeah, let's just get to the white flag. You'd be surprised, you'd think it'd be a lot more yiggly. All right, we're not losing 10% a lap, we are we 11%? Excuse me. Thank you. I think we're okay. Oh, we're also low on fuel, but you know, 8%. Oh, it's gonna be close. Six. I think we'll be okay. We'll have like 2% cross the line. Just about. Here we go. We're gonna, use some, yeah, we're gonna use a little bit right rear right there. All right. Three. Two. <laughs> we're gonna do it. Yes. Way to earn that Who needs that fucking right rear tire? All right, yeah. Let me do my burnout. Start. All right, Dick and Balls, Kentucky edition. Uh, where are we going? Uh, let's see here. We tried it on the pavement in Texas. We're gonna we're gonna try it back in the grass here. We're gonna try to do a little skinny Dick and Balls down here. I think we can fit it in right here. Let's see here. This might be a little mini mini set of Dick and Balls here. All right, we got one testicle. We got a we got a we got a building block here. Now the, the trick is to get it pointed and to connect the testicle. See now they're now they're gonna be this one's coming out as an oval, so they're gonna be a little disproportionate. But you know, every once in a while you get a disproportionate set of balls. All right, how are we looking here at the balls? Okay. Got one really big fucking ball. That's all right. <laughs> it's better than having a set of just tiny little nuts. At least you got one big one. All right, shaft, and then the cherry on top. All right, let's drive around and see what we got here. This might be my best, like, complete, my most complete set of dicked balls here. Oh, I lost a testicle. Fuck off, man. Let's see if I can put it back. Oh, it's driving away! My testicle's driving away! Damn it! Now my shaft's- Aw! Oh, for NASCAR Heat 6, can I just, like, have my tire track stay put? That was gonna come out alright, I think. Damn it! We have to try doing it on the pavement next time. Alright, there's my Kentucky Dickin' Balls, everybody. Thanks for coming out. Dams. Alright, well, look at the finishing results. Let's go. It set, was our seventh win of the season. Eat shit, everybody. Uh, had some tire problems today, but uh, that's okay. Fucking good. You're going to have it every once in a while. Now look at the rest of it. Jordan Anderson with a big meaty run. Gillen, P7. But Ross Chastain, P5. Uh, but then again, you got to account for the stage points as well, so we'll see how it shakes out. But look at the rest of it here. Uh, 21 on the lead lap, all the way down to Tate Fogelman. Ah, oh, he had problems today. That sucks. Well, that brings us to the Eldor Dirt Derby next. Before we go, though, oh, Ross Chastain must have got some meaty stage points. 23 back now for Todd Gillen. Zane Smith, 67 out. Uh, Eck is 74 out. Brett Moffitt's had an awful season, 82 out. Well, <laughs> it's shaking, shaking up to be pretty boring here at the end, so I think it's just about set. Well, we still got Eldor to get through, so you never know. But that's going to do it. So hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Uh, the next one should probably be Eldora and then Michigan, and then that'll be just kind of the regular season finale episode, and then we'll go into the playoffs. So, hope you guys enjoyed. We'll catch y'all in the next one.